Squarespace Yoga Website Tutorial Creating Yoga Website on Squarespace Hello guys, Celia here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we easily create yoga website on Squarespace Here we are on the homepage, so let's get started Firstly we need to click on Get Started button right up here and as you can see we are on the templates area where we can find a lot of different templates So yeah, uh, Squarespace is a website builder which provides us the opportunity to customize the template so it's pretty easy and as you can see we have like option to switch between different types and topics but as for me i think that the most the easiest way is to find the suitable template and to customize every single part because we can change every single picture every single text but let's click on fitness area to try to find something which is suitable as for us and maybe this website is pretty cool i think yeah let's click on preview and here we are as you can see it looks like this on the uh, desktop and we can also sw switch between like tablet and uh, phone so as you can see it's totally responsive as for me it's pretty cool let's start with this template and let's click on start with this design and we have to create an account we can continue with gmail and i'm going to do like this as for me this is the most suitable variant so i already have an account so here we are and we'll come to our dashboard where we can manage all of our websites let it be like yoga uh, continue next next and get started and we'll start from the like you know managing page where we can manage all the stuff about this website but if we'll click on this uh, squarespace icon we'll come to the dashboard from which we can find all the website settings so our website looks like this we can click on more we can change the permissions manage billing settings duplicate website or delete and we can also manage the domains from this part here so i'm going to uh, my manage page and here we are let's start customization firstly i'm going to design area right up here I'm going to click on site styles and i'm going to change the font group so i'm come right up here click on font pack switch and from this page we can easily change the wall fonts on our website so as you can see now it looks like this and it's pretty cool that uh, like you know uh, Squarespace provides us the opportunity to switch between different font packs and I think it's pretty cool so let it be like this one here so let's click on save and it may take a little time uh, so let's wait for a little and also I'd like to customize all the color palette of our website and Squarespace also provides us the opportunity to do this so uh, only after this uh, let's go click on site styles back to site styles going to click on colors edit palette and from this page here we can easily uh, change all the colors on our website so let it be like this one here let's click on save and in a few seconds everything is basically done so i'm going back to colors size styles and i'm going to click on close and we'll come to our editor from this page here we can simply customize every single part here every single element so if you we'll hover for example on this image we can simply click and we have the option to duplicate to delete or to edit so as you can see we have like replace option edit option we can add the link add the image alt text add the file name and so on i'm going to click on replace i'm going to browse some stock images let's try to search for yoga images here and i'm going to use this image click on add image and as you can see in a few seconds everything is done we can simply upload our own images if we need and this is a way of how can we interact with uh, images here in this case we can easily customize every single element simply click click on edit and here we are we can find the like option to change the text let it be like helper man yoga we can hover we can like highlight make it bold italic change the color and the steps are quite simple and in this case we can customize every single element on this website also i'd like to change the like size of the block make it wider to let it like take less time as for me is better 
also we can easily uh, manage our section space for example here we can just simply click and make it like less we can add some more blocks we can click on add section we can add the contact info about people products services so they have a lot of templates we can easily use for our sections so let's add the team for example and as you can see it was successful edit we can edit the section by simply like move it down we can edit the uh, section like change the format background colors we can edit the content change all the stuff here for example like content with different guys we can add different pictures information and description and as for me it's pretty pretty cool so in this case we can interact with uh, these blocks here so these are the ways of how can we interact with this navigation. We can also add some text. For example, we can just simply click on add block. We can add text, image, button, video, audio form and so on. So let's try to add button maybe and we'll move it somewhere here. For example, if we have some maybe, I don't know, courses and maybe subscription plans, we can add the, them right up here. So let's try to buy you know course let's be like this so in this case we can interact with every single element and if we'll click on save all the changes will be successfully published now we can exit our website and here we are uh, from this page here we can also find a lot of analytics if you'll come to analytics page we can find the uh, traffic traffic sources and so on so you can easily analyze every single visit of your website and as for me it's pretty cool uh, as you can see we also have like commerce options to manage our like products orders and so on marketing area where we can optimize our ceo optimization on website scheduling asset library profile settings and so on so these are the main features if you'll try to discover their paid plans we can find that they have like two plans on personal and business and it also provides us the opportunity to uh, try it for free for 14 day trial so you can easily try squarespace website builder for free and after that we can decide is it necessary as for us to buy personal business and so on we can find all the differences here but as for me the best variant is to try and after that to decide what is the best so they have like different features and maybe the business features are not like that important for you so this is the way of how can we build our yoga website on squarespace i hope guys this video helped you out if you have any questions you can write them in the comments below please subscribe to my channel like this video and write your comment i wish you a very good day goodbye